What's up everybody, my name is Michael Gardner and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how you can travel the world for free with Workaway. Now before we get into the video, go ahead and leave a like, that way some other aspiring travelers can come across this video and maybe just have a massive breakthrough with the understanding that you can travel the world now and you don't need to wait. So a little bit of background, I am a serial entrepreneur, but I would also consider myself a digital nomad. I've been to over 25 countries while building my business, and this is a platform that if I had known about it back when I was first starting my business, I would have jumped right on. Because one thing I hear all the time is, Michael, I wanna travel, my business isn't big enough. Well, this might just solve your problem, cut down your expenses, and be a great platform for you to use to travel while starting your business. So let's go ahead and jump into my computer and get right into it. All right, so in this video, as promised, I'm gonna be showing you how you can travel the world for free using Workaway. Now, what is Workaway? Workaway is a platform that connects travelers with hosts who you can work for in exchange for free food and rent. Workaway itself is really cheap. I think it costs around $50 for a year, but right now they have a six months extra membership for three to support them due to all of the tra crazy travel restrictions. So how does Workaway work? You join the platform, you're able to search a connective hosts and then travel like a local. So let me go ahead and break down a bit more about how this works and why it's really so great. So let's say that you want to travel to India. I could put in India, or I could even put in a specific city in India. For this example, I'm just gonna put in India. Now, what I can go ahead and do is hit search, and I can see that there are a ton of different people hosting travelers in India. There are 36 pages, so quite a lot to sort through. Now, the cool thing is just like Airbnb, you're able to apply filters. So I can put this with feedback filter. I can also go ahead and go down to host score. So I wouldn't wanna save a host who has a, basically a 40% satisfaction rate. I want like 90 and up. So it limits it down to 149 hosts. Now, I can even do more filters and see what type of work they are looking for in exchange for stay. So how this works is you are typically volunteering four to five hours a day with organizations, families, charities, sometimes even businesses in exchange for free food and rent. So if you wanna travel while growing your business, this is a great opportunity. You might only have to work 15 to 25 hours a week for free food and rent, but that still gives you plenty of time to work on your business and you have the ability to travel without worrying about expenses. So for this example, I'm not gonna worry about filtering the type of work. I'm just gonna choose the host score. I can do other things like availability and accommodation info. I can see how many people can they host. Um, we, let's do this. Internet access available and digital nomad friendly even. And some hosts do ask for a fee, but it's very few. I'll check the box for hosts that don't ask for a fee. And we still have 41 great hosts. So let's go ahead and check this out. You can see there are a ton of different workaway options. Come work at a histy, hippie hostel. Um, work at a yoga uh, type place. You can help a family if it's a sustainable project in a village, eco project in an authentic mountain village. So let's look at this one, for example. I could, go, I could go ahead and open it up I can see the host is 100% satisfaction rating. There are 47 pieces of feedback and the host has been active today. He also replies to 95.5% of people who reach out and replies on average within 10 days. So down here I can see a calendar of when they need volunteers and also the minimum stay required, which is one month. You then get a description of what type of work and how exactly you staying there will work with this specific host as well as the types of projects the projects um, as well as the type of projects and also cultural exchange and learning opportunities and the specific, as well as the types of projects cultural exchange and learning opportunities as well as the help that they are looking for language accommodation and a bunch more we can see we have internet access which is huge for digital nomads 
and they also have indicated that they love having digital nomad stay, which is absolutely great. So for this, you're gonna be working four to five hours a day on average, five days a week. So you're talking 20 to 25 hours a week for three accommodation and food. You can see all the great reviews. So if you wanna travel, start your business and don't wanna worry about expenses, you can come stay at a beautiful place like this in the middle of the Indian mountains, hang out with really cool people, have a free place to stay, not have to worry about money, learn some new skills even, and also at the same time, just get to have amazing opportunities to meet new people and a bunch of time to grow your business. So that is it for Workaway. Go ahead and check it out. It's really great and it's something that I am highly fond of. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I think Workaway is a fantastic tool for any entrepreneur who wants to travel but is brand new, or maybe someone who just doesn't even want to start a business, but they just want some cool cultural and traveling experiences. So if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to hit that thumbs up. It takes 0.001 second and it makes my day. Make sure to subscribe and stay tuned for future videos.